All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today we're back to talk about changes that are coming to Discord account names. What does that mean? Is it scary? I will basically fill you in on all of the finer details. So right now, if you just pick a random person in the sidebar over here and you click on them, you'll see that their username is usually some like basic numbers or letters plus a hashtag and some numbers that come after it. And that is for the most part what people see across Discord, unless you give yourself a server nickname like this person did where they've named themselves uh, 3THBE. But that kind of makes it a little bit hard to find your friends, to add them to your friends list manually. It's kind of confusing when you use just one system name across the entirety of Discord. So they're bringing in a new system which involves display names and a new version of your old username, which I will call system names, because that's what the system knows you by and it's how they keep track of your account between servers is via your system name. And so the idea here is they're giving you a universal or a global display name or nickname that works across every server by default. And of course, you can still give yourself a server specific nickname. That particular functionality isn't going to change. What is going to change is they're going to allow you to have a crazy nickname or a display name where you can have a bunch of different letters or characters and even some emoji so long as it complies with the Discord community guidelines. And then they will be asking you to change your username to something that doesn't include the numbers anymore. And to do this, they'll be rolling it out slowly by asking the oldest accounts first to change their names and then moving on to newer ones. So when you get the chance, make sure you snipe your name quickly so that somebody else doesn't try to yoink your really cool name. That said, even if someone does have like a common name, like you have a favorite anime character, even if someone does manage to snipe that from you, you will be able to put it in your display name so that everybody can see your cool name, regardless of what other people are doing. And uh, if you would like to know more about these changes, you can go over to the blog post about it on Discord's website, which will go into finer detail about the rules and regulations that go through all of that, how they kind of arrived at the decision to make these changes to the nicknames and uh, why they've decided to do this. I would say it's probably to keep it in line with like a lot of other games are doing where they have a display name and then your account name is more like what you log in with and what the system identifies you with. Steam as a good example, most people probably have a completely different Steam login for their account than is actually their current, their current, like most recently used nickname. Like my Larry Chupacabra name has not always been the name I went on on both Steam and in different friends lists. I've gone through a cavalcade of names over the years and currently use a few different nicknames on a few different servers. So this won't be too crazy for a lot of people. And then if you want to read about the nitty gritty of why they decided to make this changes after all this time, you can do so here. They also have some more information on their Discord town hall where they share a lot of this most up-to-date information right here that tells you the rules and regulations regarding it and when you can start to see when the eligibility will come to you so that you can change your name and eventually everybody will be changed to the new system. Uh, if you're curious as to when you have to make those changes, uh, if I go down to my server and you like right-click my profile, it tells you right here, member since October 2nd, 2015. So I've been very early on um, and then created this server November 4th, 2015 to start doing tutorial stuff. And then you can kind of look over here like my buddy Imperial. He's been here since December 31st, 2015. Uh, this guy here has been in since August 9th, 2019. And then joined not too long after in September 16, 2019 to my server. So you can kind of get an idea of when you and your friends can expect to be invited to change your names. It shouldn't be too crazy, though, um, unless you're really attached to like a very, very, very specific account name. 
otherwise, I think it might end up being a good quality of life improvement because right now you don't really have a, a nickname that you can see across all of Discord. All you really have is your account name and that's it. You'd have to then go in every single server and then change your nickname, which a lot of people do, and I've done to a certain degree, but isn't always the funnest thing. So that'll be it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Bye, everybody, and have a good one.